Presently am a uh, full professor in the School of Communication. My current title is University Professor. It's a, a title given to people who have been active internationally in their field and who work across disciplinary borders and institutional borders within American University. I've been there for 20 years and I uh, have um, I have a bunch of roles at the university and then I also have roles outside the university. I, I teach about documentary film and I also train our um, in um, what it means to be a college professor and how to do it. So I train them in teaching skills and career skills and in, in job opportunity skills. The other big job of mine inside the university is that I started the Center for Social Media in 2000, which is part of our School of Communication, as a place to showcase media that matters and particularly documentary that matters. So outside the university, I have worked a lot with public television. I served on the board of Independent Television Service, which produces a lot of documentaries for public television. Uh, and I've worked closely with the Corporation for Public Broadcasting. Um, I've also worked um, as uh, a consultant to the Council on Foundations uh, in their uh, producing their um, uh, festival. It's called the Film and Video Co Council on Foundations Film and Video Festival, and it showcases films uh, that have been funded by private foundations and showcases the best of those films. And that's really acquainted me with a lot of really interesting nonprofit work. Um, and I also serve on the board of Cartemquin Films, uh, which is an independent production house in Chicago, as well as uh, working with some of my professional associations. At the time, film culture, this is late 60s, early 70s, film culture is dominant in the United States. So unlike today, films are hard to see. You, there's no VCRs, there's no DVDs, there's no online. You go to a theater. And unlike today, there's a real sense of a body, of the importance of film as, as, a, as a cultural experience. And the feeling that film is the rising and leading form, art form and expressive form of our time. So in the way that 19th century people wrote novels, 20th century people are making movies. And movies are, especially for those of us who grew up in places like northern Minnesota, they're our gateway to culture and international culture. 